Hi Aries, welcome to Angel Love 333. I hope you're all well, you're healthy and you're safe. We're gonna do a message here from your soulmate, all right? Before we get into your message and while I'm pulling your cards here, uh, I wanna say everything you need to know is in the description box. Uh, if you would like to follow me on social media, all of that info is below as well, uh, TikTok and Instagram. So with that, we're going to get started here, Aries. Uh, I'm going to pull a few cards here from um, the tarot. Uh, we also have here the Triden, uh, the Triden, <laughs> the Hidden Truth uh, Oracle and the Lover's Oracle, which we'll pull after we do the tarot per portion here for more specific messages from your person. Um, oh, okay. All right, message from a, your, your um, soulmate here. I feel here, you got the judgment card here. So there's definitely an indication here that you're going to hear from this person. This person here wants to tell you that they want to make things right. They want to reconcile here. I do feel this is somebody here from your past. Um, I, you know, with that judgment card here, you have the three of cups. So this is someone who I feel... They want to tell you that they have a lot of love for you. You have the Ten of Cups and you have the Three of Cups. So I feel this is an indication that this person here um, is going to message you here pretty soon, right? They're making the decision here. I feel like they want to tell you too that they've really, um, they know uh, that they've messed things up. They know that uh, there's definitely some things from the past uh, that choices or decisions that they made that weren't right and I feel this is somebody here now wanting to reconnect with you wanting to to reconcile with you okay um I feel here too this person may have had some past healing here all right but there's definitely an energy here of celebration happiness uh they want to tell you that they have a lot of love for you look at that you have the nine of cups on the bottom of the deck you also have here the Ace of Pentacles, and you have here the Knight of Swords. So I feel this person here, they definitely, um, I feel like they feel like they messed things up in the past. And I feel like this is somebody here, they want to bring things back to a place where the two of you can be happy, where you can rebuild that foundation. And I also get the energy here. Look at that, Nine of Swords, right? They're coming to you, I feel here, pretty quickly. So this is someone who's wanting to reconnect. And uh, the message is here, uh, I feel strongly here. They may have messed up in the past. Uh, they may have been, I'm going to say this person too, I feel like they may have been a little bit selfish here. Uh, but this is someone who wants to build for the future here. And they want to let you know that they're coming towards you. Are coming in pretty quickly. Let's see what the hidden uh, truth oracle says here. We're going to pull three messages and my deck is upside down. Okay. And I'm going to pull three uh, oracles as well. Oh boy, they are just flying out. Okay. So, um, Aries, your first message is, I replay our conversations over and over again, right? With the judgment card, I feel this is, like I said, this person who is looking back on the past. They're thinking about your conversations. They're thinking about their actions, their decisions, their choices. And there's an element here I feel they're not feeling too happy with um, looking back on the decisions or the actions that they took here with you. All right. Uh, the second card you have is it was my fault, but I blamed you. And I feel this person here, this is where they want to rebuild trust. So there may have been a conversation between you and this person that they weren't taking responsibility, right? They were putting it on you is the energy I get there. And then you also have here, look at that. I want to feel that way again. Okay. Yeah, they're coming rushing in, 
right? Because the way that they felt with you was the Ten of Cups or the way that they feel with you is the Ten of Cups. So I feel for those of you who are watching this is somebody, either you're in an argument with this person, there's uh, maybe a break in communication or distance, or this is someone uh, that you may have, uh, there may have been a breakup here, all right? The next card uh, you have here is freedom. There is nothing stopping you. The path is clear if you want it to be, okay? So I feel what this message here is, um, this person is wanting to tell you that they understand, right? If they come back around or when they, I should say when they come back around, because I do see this person is coming towards you. I feel that they're telling you it's your choice, right? You have the freedom to walk away, right? If you cannot accept what has happened. But I feel like this person is rushing towards you um, to really show you that uh, they do want to take responsibility. And I feel like this person here wants to reconnect, wants to reconcile and possibly heal, right? What needs to be healed here? You have um, here, criticizing one another will only lead to further unhappiness. Love and accept each other as you are and your relationship will magically transform. So with this energy, I feel like your person is hoping that you're going to accept them. Uh, I will say they're hoping that you're going to be open to rebuilding uh, this connection um, or to move past the conflict or whatever happened in the past. I feel though, you know, if you criticize this person, um, that, you know, they're gonna run back the other way, okay? Because they're coming in as the Knight of Swords here. So they may be somebody who, you know, has their own fears to begin with. And then the last card you have is passion. A magnetic and seductive quality surrounds you at present. Enjoy it, all right? So I feel it's an indication that this person is very attracted to you. There's a lot of chemistry here and they have a lot of passion for you. And this is someone I feel that um, maybe they didn't realize it in the past, but this is somebody who does see you as somebody they could be happy with in the future. So Aries, that was your message there from your soulmate here. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, please give it a thumbs up. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day or evening. And I'm sending you angel love.